hi everyone welcome back again to my youtube channel my name is kosi and in today's video i will be sharing with you how to make a simple elastic off shoulder blouse so if you're interested to learn how i made this you want to keep on watching and let's get started and please not forget to subscribe so you're notified anytime i upload a new video so guys this is the fabric i want to make use of and what i have here is a lacquer material all right and i have one yard plus eight inches so if you are making yours with ankara like if you want to make this blouse with ankara make sure you have at least one and a half yard of fabric all right so now we are going to fold it into two just like this you can see um how i'm folding it fold it into two you can see it's on a fold after folding you will fold it again all right so right now when you fold it you are going to have a fold of four all right you're going to have a fold of four then after um placing everything together next thing you're going to do now is to add 15 inches to your ultra round shoulder circumference my round shoulder circumference is 38 inches plus 15 inches all right i'll have 53 inches now i'm going to divide the 53 inches by 6.28 so when i do that i have 8.4 inches but i want to make use of 8.5 inches that means i want to make use of um eight and a half all right so after placing my tape at the tip i'll go ahead and come down by 8.5 inches all right so i'll use it to form a circle just like this all right so now after marking the next thing i want to do is to get the length of this top all right so for the length i'll make use of 12 inches but if you are working with one and a half yard with your car fabric then you have at least 13 inches or 14 inches all right you can see my is a way too short my is just short if you want yours to come down a little bit like if you want yours to have length you can set to make it 14 15 inches depending on the fabric you use or how many yards of fabric you used so right now i'm marking 12 inches all right together with the folding allowance all right so after marking just use it to form a circle use it to make a circle like this after marking you can see what i have here this is very simple to make so right now you are going to also go ahead on the upper part you are going to come up by half an inch so this is for the stitching allowance all right add half an inch at the top for your stitching allowance all right so now after that you are also going to go ahead and cut it out after marking go ahead and cut it out all right So guys once i'm done with the cutting you can see what i have here can you see all right so i'm going to just mark the wrong side of the fabric using my chalk the next thing to do is to open it up like this now you're going to head over to your sewing machine all right head over to your sewing machine go ahead and sew all right you're going to fold it like this you can see how i'm folding mine you fold it like this then you go ahead and sew all right is it that you weave the mouth if you are making use of ankara is it that you weave the mouth then you sew or you fold it by two then you sew just like this all right continue doing this until you get to the other end so guys once i'm through with that you can see what i have here so we are going to fold in half an inch all right we are going to pass our elastic through there all right so when sewing um you're going to at least leave one inch space because you're going to pass in our elastic we're going to fix our elastic be inside the elastic anyhow you choose to understand it all right just go ahead and leave at least one inch space so that you're going to be able to pass your elastic through that side okay and again the next thing i did was to also fold the hem part just fold it into two you get so now this is the elastic you can see i have two colors combination black and white this is because my elastic wasn't enough all right so i had to join to give me a long elastic all right so since my around shoulder circumference is 38 i will remove 10 inch from the 38 you can see i removed the 10 inches from 38 and what i will have left is 28 inches all right so if your shoulder circumference is 40 that means you're going to remove 10 inch from your elastic so when you remove it you have 30 inches left so for me mine is 38 so i removed 10 inches i had 28 inches left so i'll just go ahead and measure it all right 
what I have here is 28 inches as you can see so I'll just cut off the excess after that I will now um, use my safety pin then I'll just pass it through the space I left okay So once I'm through with that, I'll go ahead and tie it very well. Make sure you tie very properly. Alright? Make sure it's very, very tight. So it's either you tie it very well like this or you sew the boot elastic together. Like you're draining them. Alright? So after that, I'll just go ahead and cut off the excess. Alright? After cutting the excess, I'll put the elastic inside. Then I'll head over straight to my sewing machine. To stitch the opening, okay, just go ahead and stitch the opening. So, guys, after stitching, this is what I have here. Alright, so this is how you go about making this simple off shoulder elastic blouse. Alright. So, guys, this will be the end of our today's tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.